what's going on? Part two, bounty hunter, challenger. Um, quick review. I've had it out twice. Paid 99 bucks for it at Bass Pro Shops. It came with a plastic trowel, which is pretty nice. Uh, I'm thinking I would have missed some of these smaller items, uh, like the earrings, if I would have used the the sand scoop, which I used to use all the time. But having it out twice, I found uh, $13 approximately in change. Um, two 14 karat gold rings. Uh, one just gold, one with diamonds and a blue topaz 14 karat, which I returned today. Sterling silver St. Christopher metal. Some costume jewelry, possibly some diamond earrings. If those are diamonds, look out. I don't think they are, but if they are, they're worth some big coin. Um, Shack, spent shotgun shell, piece off a coach purse, a couple of keys. Uh, that's a pretty good haul for two days. Uh, I'm pretty pretty happy with this thing. Again, keep the sensitivity all the way, the one on the left, keep it all the way to high and disc or notch keep off. Because you got to dig every target anyway. Uh, I'm finding hairpins, little uh, three centimeter long pieces of rusty nails and stuff. So that tells me this is a good detector, regardless of what I paid for it. Uh, I'm finding things. The slightest